Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters Today I'm reacting to a video called One Quran verse made me a Muslim Yusha Evans So this video is about brother Yusha Evans And I think he will be telling about his story How he came to Islam inshallah Let's begin this video inshallah When I was able to go to the masjid for the first time in 1998 And the imam gave a very beautiful khutbah It, it touched me Masha'Allah. When I went to him after the salah and, and, and asked him, because he started telling me about Islam, you know how our da'wah goes. You know, Islam is built on five pillars and six, uh, six beliefs. And I said, look, I just want to know, do you have some proof? You know, like where, where, where is the proof that your religion is what you say it is? And he smiled. He's like, you know, he said, I got you. So he went and pulled a book off the shelf and he handed it to me. And my first proof handed to me about the deen of Al-Islam was the Qur'an. He said, this is it. This is our proof. And then he started to tell me about the Qur'an. You know, that it was revealed to the Prophet. I said, look, look, no, 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 no. I've already had people try to pre-sale me. You know, he's already trying. He's like, he's trying to load me up to go read this Qur'an with a certain frame of mind. I said, no, 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 don't do that. L let me read this book. If it is what you say it is, it'll prove itself. This was, this was the amount of... of, of certainty that I had that if God had a religion, it would be clear, crystal for someone who was searching. So I took the Quran home and that was on a Friday evening and I started reading it. And I remember reading Surah Al-Fatiha. Uh, well, first I remember reading it and realizing that the book was backwards because I was given one of those blue noble Qurans from Saudi and I opened it and I'm like, I'm in the index. I'm in the, I'm like, whoa, whoa. So I realized they had to flip it over or the reading the other way. So I opened the Quran and I read Surah Al-Fatiha. All praise belongs to Allah who is the Lord of all the worlds. The most gracious, the most merciful, the master of the day of judgment. You alone do we worship and you alone do we seek our assistance. Guide us to the straight path. The path of those who have earned your favor, not the path of those who have earned your anger, nor of those who have gone astray. As soon as I read that, Jesus is... Prayer that he taught his disciples in the Bible came to mind. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and, and lead us, uh, you know, uh, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. And there were such glaring similarities. Like when I watched the message for the first time, and, and when King Najashi said that what you have said and what we have is like, Two rays from the same lamp. That was the feeling that I got reading Surah Al-Fatiha. And then I turned over to Surah Al-Baqarah. And the first verse Matt, had no meaning to me whatsoever. ALM. The second verse is the reason I decided to look into Islam. It's the reason I decided to keep reading the Quran. It could very well be the reason I'm a Muslim today. It's Surah Al-Baqarah, verse 2. This is the book. So interestingly, this verse of the Quran led the brother Yusha Evans to start re reading about Islam, to start uh, his journey in Islam. This is what I understood. This verse is, is a profound, it's very profound. It's the second chapter of the Quran, Surah Al-Baqarah, verse 2, which says this is the book about which there is no doubt, a guidance for those conscious of Allah. And this is a Sahih International translation. I believe, alhamdulillah, there were other factors about Islam that made the brother choose Islam. This was a short video, but a good one. And I would like to see the complete, the complete version of that video, inshallah. I hope you subscribe to this channel, my brothers and sisters. Like this video and share this video with everyone as much as you can, inshallah, with everyone you know, Muslims, non-Muslims. And uh, tell me in the comment section below what video would you like me to react to, inshallah. I hope to see more of my brothers and sisters in this channel, inshallah. I want to share my journey with you, my journey of reaction, my journey of learning. And soon, inshallah, my journey of cooking as well, because I want to create a new YouTube channel. Like I said uh, in my uh, previous video, just like Allahu Hayran, Assalamu Alaikum.